So we're in the beautiful little town of Centra, which is about an hour outside of Lisbon. And it's where all of the royal families, I think, built their castles. So we're going to go and explore. Emma's trying to make her next million dollar movie. So Centra is sort of filled with places that look like this, these huge castles. Cafe Paris in Lisbon. Centra, rather. So this is Quinta Regalia, and it's an incredible old house, but what's more remarkable is the gardens, apparently. So we're going to go and check it out. Bunny. Wow, look how huge it is. So that's that walk along the garden, yeah. along the road, up to the tennis courts, up to the aquarium. Let's do it. Ooh. These little pathways. There's a spiral staircase inside the wall here. I'm going up this one. That's where you can uh, do your Satan worship. You can lower it and put the virgins on it with this uh, handle, which is uh, locked up right now. Come on, then, you need to come up. Going up that. All right, we're going up now. Here comes Emma now. <laughs> One way. Did you get the rest of the way? It's pretty steep. See the uh, Pella Palace at the very top there. I was going in search of the tunnel. crazy thing you can go and play on. So in here somewhere is the tunnel. Let's go have a look. Oh, there it is. Oh, how cool is this? to uh, turn my cell phone on so we can see where we're going. Oh, here we go. Look at this. Oh, yeah, this is wet. <laughs> Whoa, it goes down far, hey? Oh, God, this is 
scary. This is the bit you wanted to see. That is deep. Is it? So in there, there's a hidden door. You have to find the handle for it and then you can get in. Now we're at the very top of the well. And I'm too tall for this stuff. Now it has another hidden door. That should give you a sense of how deep it is. Most people don't fall down there to their horrible deaths all the time. Yeah, this is the way out. It was quite invigorating, that was. Where did Emma go? Where'd you go, honey? Made it to the very back, honey. Yeah, I don't know if we're in the right place. No, we are. Yeah, That's the back gate. Maybe. Maybe come up this way. Yeah, but we intrepid adventurers, they not. I think this is a Grotto of the Virgin. I think that's the Grotto of the Virgin. I may have seen better days. Stairs and found this little pond, a bit murky. But this place is just full of surprises. I'm going back out into the rain again now. So now we're going to go up into the house itself. So it's going, undergoing a bit of cleaning. to the mansion. It's a main entrance hall or living room, I'm not sure. It's dining room. Check that fireplace, it's just absolutely stunning. That's what it really looked like. So this is the main entrance. This is what Emma's entrance hall needs to look like, I think, for her to be happy. One day. A snooker room? Yeah. Wow. That's the lights. Well, that's pretty much the tour of the place. It's quite remarkable, actually. Highly recommend it. Wonderful. You need about three or four hours to really get to have a good walk around and explore. So this is the way out. Heading towards the exit now. Last look back up at the gardens. And a last look back up at the house. To say I, uh, the house is just awesome, but they have blocked off most of it and turned it into quite an austere museum inside, rather than sort of keeping the original interior features and, and, and making it like the home it was. So I hope someday somebody will come along and rip out all of those horrible museum things and try to restore it into a home again. So we're back in uh, Maintown Central right now. Just sort of walking around, checking out the shops.